was the first time watching LeBron, you could see mentally he was frustrated. Just the way he started to play there towards the end of the game, you could just see that he was not feeling that roster and the way those guys are competing right now. And that, that's, I mean, the crowd wasn't even booing. I mean, it's almost like they had mentally checked out. I've never seen that kind of a dynamic. Well, you can look at an out-of-context clip, and it's LeBron taking on five defenders. Not a yeah. single one of his teammates even jogged back no. for the offensive possession. I mean, uh, the, he's playing so well, too. Yeah. I mean, he's had this spurt after, you know, coming off the injuries and the COVID where he is just playing lights-out basketball. And it's unfortunately for the Lakers and him that um, Anthony Davis is out. But I know he's looking to say, we don't want to be just in the play because if you're six, seven, eight, you're playing the Phoenix Golden State, which is Utah, what happened last year. And you first so, round exit. And if you win in one of those, you're going to take so much energy to be the Phoenix, to be the Golden State Warriors, to be the Utah. And then you go to the second round and this team is not built to say, oh, we got to the conference finals. They're built to win a championship every year because that's what you got to do. If you have LeBron James left with three or four seasons left in his career. This is, it's, I, I, to me, it's, they don't have any effort guys. They don't have a lot of effort guys just to come out there. Sometimes you're going to have your defensive rotations where you want it to be, but you see the effort of guys just scrambling. You say, well, they're going to get it together. They don't have the scheme. They don't have the personnel, and they don't have effort guys defensively. I think they'll be fine offensively, defensively what I'm worried about. So what do you do? Where do you go? They can't, well, it's all got to be done internally. Um, they'll be... I would assume that there are going to be some more people now starting to look at what the front office is doing. Um, done because or done. Or done, yeah. And, and listen, it it was a small thing, but the fact that they don't, like the fact that they didn't value Caruso enough to bring him back last year, that that was telling to and me. And you watch the way he's played in Chicago. I mean, he, he Effort. listen. And look at the, what, what the is, holes that the roster Kristen, you heard what Smitty just said. He just said they need effort energy guys. What is Caruso? Yeah. Like they KCP. don't have guys like that. KCP, like it's, it's you know. It's, <laughs> you mentioned the audience member, uh, what, falling asleep? <laughs> yeah, like they didn't they're, do that they're, when he was listen, there. this is a, they're a really bad basketball team. Uh, they've got a lot of guys that don't impact.